What is going on guys and welcome to another video and I'm not very happy today because I have a feeling that the Redskins are about to lose one of their starting wide receivers in Pierre Garcon which has been amazing help and now Garcon or now Kirk and Kirk Cousins maybe too if you can read that tweet I don't know how significant these are but Kirk Cousins to 49ers is all but not all but done considered it 90% likely. No words on specific to be announced later. That is crazy. And then another thing came out today. When Pierre Garçon finalizes his deal, as expected, he will make $16 million in his first year. First of all, that is way overpaid for Pierre Garçon. But I'm very mad because we might be losing Pierre Garçon and now Kirk Cousins maybe if we decide to trade him. I don't think we're going to trade Kirk, but I will be very, very, very pissed off if we do. And if Garcon actually does sign, because this isn't legit yet. It isn't uh, a done deal yet. It's like really close, I'm guessing. But these are just reports, rumors, you know. And if that does happen, I'm going to be very upset. Because then now we'll have to bring back Deshaun Jackson. And if Deshaun goes somewhere else, we lose Garcon and Deshaun, and that would be dumb. That would be pointless. That's a stupid move by Washington. So hopefully they can re-sign Gar or re-sign Deshaun Jackson before something happens when he is also rumored to go to Tampa Bay, which I'd be okay with if it's not the Eagles. But I really don't want to lose Garcon and Deshaun. I want to bring back at least one of them. Like we can't lose both of them. I was really wanting to bring back Pierre Garcon, but. I don't know, according to this tweet, which is just a tweet, we may be losing him, and I'm not very happy about that, because Pierre Garçon has been amazing for the last, I don't know how long he's been here, like four, to th four, five, three years, or something like that, when RG3 was still around, I think that was his first year, so, he's been around here for a while, man, and I really don't want him to leave, but if we lose him, that would suck. So as free agency is getting kicked off, I'm already hearing bad news about Garcon going to San Francisco. And now Kirk Cousins may be following. Actually, Kirk's news came out before. Like, this has been rumored heavily. I already did a video over it. If you haven't looked at that, make sure to check it out. It is uh, the 49ers offseason. I bring Kirk there. I didn't bring Garcon there because I didn't know about this rumor until just now. And it sucks. It's a sucky rumor. As a Redskins fan, I don't want to see these two both gone. I mean, one of them might be okay, but if Kirk has to go, that's fine. But Garcon, that's going to hit me big because he is a great wide receiver. And it honestly almost doesn't even seem like Kirk Cousins wants to be in Washington anymore, which kind of pisses me off as well. And I really hope he stays and we don't trade him. But at this point, if we don't trade him, I don't feel like franchise tagging him next year I think that's like way too much money I think uh, the franchise tag will cost a lot of money for him next year so I want to get something for him so if we do have to trade him I guess that's what we're gonna have to do which sucks but we're gonna have to do it if it's necessary and Kirk is just seeming like he doesn't want to be here and it sucks, man. It sucks. So, even if we do pull the trigger on the trade, there's been rumors about the three-team trade with Tony Romo, the second-round pick. Second-round pick going to Cowboys. Romo comes to Washington, and Kirk goes to 49ers. I don't think that is a significant rumor anymore that was rumored, like, a week ago or maybe a few days ago. And now, as I heard the trade, only thing that the 49ers could give us for Kirk is their second, their second pick in the draft, which is pretty cool, having a second pick. But, I don't know, man. I don't want to get rid of Kirk because this has been the first time in a little, in a long time that we've had a stability at quarterback. And it sucks because if we have to get rid of Kirk and what the hell, what quarterback are we going to bring in? Are we going to bring in a guy like Josh McCown or something like that? Or, I don't know, who would we bring in? And we're just going to be lost at quarterback again. And I don't want that. We're going to do start Colt before. Colt McCoy, hell no, man. Kirk is the answer, and I really just want them to sign him to a long-term deal and be locked in with that. But uh, the Redskins are stupid and don't want to, or he just, I don't know how much money he's requesting for exactly, but I know they gave him a $20 million deal, uh, $20 million salary, and he declined that. So uh, I don't know how much money he wants, but it's kind of getting ridiculous at this point. I really just want either Kirk to go 
I'm tired of sitting here. I don't want him to play under the franchise tag. I either want him to go or he needs to be traded. Or, I mean, not be traded. Or he needs to sign a long-term deal to stay here. We can't be playing this game anymore. I'm tired of seeing Kirk get franchise tagged. And then he's probably just going to leave next year for nothing. Like, we need to get something out of him. And if you're a Redskins fan, uh, let me know your opinion on this whole thing. Is like, how big of a blow would Garcon be going to the 49ers? And then what if Deshaun leaves as well? We'll lose both those guys. And then we'll, I mean, we'll still have James Crowder. We have promising Josh Doxson. Uh, Maurice Harris looked good in a few catches last year. And we still have Jordan Reed and Vernon Davis, obviously. But I don't want to lose both of them. I mean, Deshaun stretches the field. I'm very happy. I think we'll be okay if they both leave. I just don't want it to happen because... Jameson Crowder emerged on the scene last year. He looked like a beast. But I really just don't want them to leave. I really don't want both of them to leave. I wanted to resign both of them, to be honest, but I didn't think that was going to be possible. Now that free agency is here, we're getting rumors that Deshaun's going to Tampa Bay. Now, uh, Pierre Garcon to 49ers, and it sucks because I want both these guys. But this was a quick little video. We're going to be recapping free agency on this channel. But thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to smash that like button. If you did if you did enjoy, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. It helps me out a lot. As always guys, it's Crushables and I'm saying peace.